So far, I have visited the archives at HSP and Tyre and read the Philadelphia Barrio, The Arts, Branding, and Neighborhood Transformation by Frederick Wary. Um, through my research and reading, I have become particularly interested in the Feria del Barrio. Am I pronouncing that correctly? Okay. An annual. Well, I just learned. I just learned that, so I'll talk about that in a minute. Um, an annual neighborhood event that has taken various forms and followed different formats over the years. The Feria del Barrio can serve as a lens through which we can explore some of the challenges, tensions, and opportunities faced by the Golden Block area and Philadelphia's Puerto Rican community as a whole. Questions faced by the Feria, the Golden Block, and the broader community include, should the Feria del Barrio be an event geared toward insiders or should it try to attract outsiders? Is the Feria del Barrio a Puerto Rican event or a Latinx event? How do politicians both enhance and detract from the success of the Feria del Barrio? What is the best balance between traditional and current arts in the program of the Feria del Barrio? Who owns the Feria del Barrio? What is the appropriate balance between corporate sponsorship slash largesse and local control? These questions about the Feria del Barrio illustrate how this yearly event can provide a microcosm through which to explore larger issues that impact Philadelphia's Latinx community. And then what I updated this week, and it was really influenced a lot by what Seth said about public history and um, it, uh, you know, engaging the public and looking at the past as choices made over time. Um, I just wrote that I haven't done additional research over the summer. I have some ideas about how to make an exhibit about the Feria del Barrio interactive by having visitors think about what they would want to see and experience at a neighborhood fair and then assess which of the artifacts, images, and or documents fit or do not fit that vision.